Hey guys, it's the Glorious Pirate here, and uh, today's episode is going to be a little different. I'm actually on my way to Miami right now to do some work, and um, I have my mom and my uh, my friend here, Isaiah. Uh, say hi, guys. Hi. Uh, we're going to be playing a little mobile game called The Great Tournament. It's this awesome, interactive, 180,000 page, uh, page, word, story that you, you choose your... Your paths and your names and everything. It's it's even has like a D and D system where there's leadership, wisdom, strength, all that, gold and health. So it's pretty cool. So we're gonna we're gonna start it off here. Welcome, stranger. In this adventure, you are playing a young name man, Kaylin Stormwell, Hadrian Cartwright, Lauren Potter. Choose. Lauren Potter. What do you think? May I repeat again? Kaylin Stormwell, Hadrian Cartwright, Lauren Potter. Hadrian Cartwright. Okay, well, what's that one? Let's go. Bonanza. Anybody watch Bonanza? That's why she chose that. <laughs> okay, next. Choose a difficulty. We'll just play it easy for the first time. Okay, everybody. We have strength, agility, leadership, intelligence, wisdom, diplomacy. We have... You each have two points, including me, to put in a stack. So choose. Leadership. Leadership. One for leadership. And another one? Diplomacy. One for diplomacy. I will go strength. Okay, Mom, what's your next point? Strength, agility, leadership, intelligence, wisdom, diplomacy. Wisdom. More wisdom. All right. Isaiah? Strength. Strength. Okay, and I will put one in. We need a... We need a uh, let's see. What do I want? I, th I think... I think strength. All right. Done. The stats have been finalized. It appears we can start the adventure now. Like most things in life, you can't choose where you begin, but you can certainly influence where you end up. The crowd was louder than ever. The arena was packed this year, and it was difficult to sneak in. Luckily, you have Varys, who you consider to be your best friend. Knew about the slightly cracked wall in the, that had a hole just big enough for the two of you to crawl through. You were able to make it through the middle section of the arena. Trying to get the front row seats would be too risky, as nobles tended to have that area reserved, and you may run into a guard asking to see your ticket. The middle seats were crowded and provided anonymity. It was also provided a decent enough view for the tournament. The middle and top sections didn't have assigned seating, so they were designed more like areas for the masses to watch. Even though there were a few benches, most of them were old and broken. A few people had brought their own wooden stools to sit or stand on, and fathers had their children on their shoulders so they could see. You arrived just when the pre-tournament ceremonies were starting. Music was being played. There was also dancing and horse tricks providing entertainment to the crowd. You found this pre-tournament events to be fun and exciting? It added to the event more. Or boring? You wanted to see the fighting to begin. Or, th or the third choice is a good time to discuss tournament strategy and this year's competition with your friend. Which one? Last one. The last one? Is it? All right. Good time. After several minutes, a horn blasted to signify the first match was about to begin. You stood up on your toes and strained to see the arena floor. Walking in were two teams, each wearing garb and shields from their respective houses. The team on the left had sig sigils of griffins with white and black colored patterns, while the team on the right had sigils of horses dressed in brown colors. They are about to do combat with wooden swords, clubs, and staffs. Varys decides it would be a good time to make a bet with you, a game you often played with each other, though you knew neither of you had a coin to pay the other. Varys was a kind of enough to let you do the first pick team. You choose the left team, the griffins, or the right team, horses. Mom? The right team. The right team? Oh, let's do a little random. Okay. <coughs> we chose the Griffins. <coughs> Another horn sounded. But I'm going to have to end the episode here, guys. Um, I only have a five-minute recording time on this phone. So uh, see you 